Hey guys, Jesse here, playing the dark side detective, a fumble in the dark. Okay, so the final case for this uh, season has dropped. Uh, case number nine, Tales from the Dark Side. Other stories from the world of Dark Side. Okay, start investigation. Tales from the Dark Side. Number 1. Field of Screams Blue Dolph Doodly Oh, Doodly Okay team, I've spoken to the whoever's in charge and they say it's gonna be another few minutes before the umpire will be ready to run the pre-match safety checks For some reason, there's like a raven over here that flies over here and I'm guessing this is Officer Doodly He's a little bit of a jackass but he's also like the scout master of the blood alphas, which are all of these guys. And this one jumping over here. Uh, like I said, for some reason there's like a raven or a crow. Huh? So I guess sit tight and don't get us into any kind of mischief. Yeah, okay. So, no, nothing here. A bin. Armelia says... It is weird that we're surrounded by rubbish, maybe. And Devon says, depends on your perspective. If you were a rat, it wouldn't be that weird. That is true. Uh, teammates, Emily, Devon, Emily's pet, Armelia. Okay, the teammate says, look at them there. Twin legs, most juvenile delinquents, paying off their community service by playing ball. The system is broken, but at least it's broken in our favor, for a change. Okay. Emily. More time? What's taking so long? Those sea hags scared to face us? And Doodly says, I would be. Anyway, not much longer. How about Devin? Devin? Yep. Why are you jumping so much? Do you not think saving some of that energy for the game would be a good idea? That's a good idea. Okay, glad we agree. Yep. That's why you're the captain. I would have tried to get him to jump higher and hi faster. See how long he would have kept it up for. But he's still jumping, you know? Amelia says, Devon? Yep. I can't help but notice that you're still jumping. You see? This is Armelia. She's the captain. She noticed that this guy is still jumping. Yep, can't stop. Singing lady is making me do it. What singing lady? The singing lady. Yep, singing lady in the vent. There's a singing lady here in the vent. Okay, there appears to be a hag here in the vent. This is Armelia. Says, hey, keep your mitts to yourself. Okay. Can't believe I'm being made to send. Uh, I'm gonna eat your families off my bed for the pregame checks. Well, that might have been a little bit hardcore, if you ask me. The umpire won't let you play with something like that, says Armelia. Have we considered threatening to eat his family if he tries to stop me? Yes, we have. Might take this and look for a replacement. Okay. So, are we Armelia? Hey, keep your mitts to yourself. So proud of you all. This last time, uh, uh, this time last month, we didn't even know what a little league was. Yet here we are, facing the only other team in Twin Lakes in the championship finals, no less. Yes, because there's two teams to do. Yeah, surrounded by rubbish. I think we're playing as Armelia in this one. Uh, it's shredded paperwork. All I can make out are the words environmental, impact, and damn. That seems pretty damning, says Emily. Yes, a dumpster. The dumpster is filled with construction materials and fish sticks. What use do fish sticks uh, do fish have for sticks? Fire doesn't work underwater. I don't know. Crow. Oh, it's a crow. The carrion bird is here to feast off the dead from our epic battle with the sea hags. He'll want to get over the wheeze if it is to be a harbinger of death and destruction, though. Yeah, well said, Crow. Event. I can't hear it fully from here, but I think somebody's singing on the other side. That's the lady who is making me jump. 
What? Am I the only lady who gets to tell you what to do? I mean, I'm the only lady who gets, uh, gets to tell you what to do. Well, my mom too. Sorry, did I include your mom in my list? No, because I, and I want to be clear about this, I am the only lady, your mom included, who gets to tell you what to do. Emily is just, you know, laying down the law. Forget standing around, let's go find who's song bullying Devon and give them something to sing about. Okay, can we use the Emily's vet? Emily's bad. The face with threats of cannibalism. Cool threats of cannibalism. Yeah, we're gonna use this on this. That's a little out of my league. Okay. Are we go anywhere, Ben? To feel. Okay, we're gonna go to. I guess it wouldn't hurt to look around a little. Woohoo! Let's burn the place to the ground. Now, Emily's kind of hardcore. That is number one on the list of things we're not going to do. Number one on my list is to burn your way more, uh, your way more boring list. Okay, so we are in the field. We got some people over there. We got Detective McQueen. Here's Rexa. Look at that. We got Sea Hag Bonnie, Sea Hag Omega, Armelia's mother uh, and uncle. We got Devon's family over here. Emily's family. We got Emily, Devon. We got the scoreboard. Okay. I can't wait for the game to begin and for this board to show an appropriate type and amount of score points for whoever this game works. Okay. Devon says, I want to go back to the singing and jumping, please. Let's spend a little bit of time walking instead of jumping. Your knees will thank me in the 20 to 30 years. Yes. Okay. Can't wait for my knees to be able to talk in 20 to 30 years. Emily says, Sea hacks. Do either of them look like they're singing? I say while well, punching my fist into the palm of my hand, menacingly. Hey, keep your mitts to yourself. Okay. Let's see the sea hags. Why, hi there, sugars. Looking forward to a fun day of sports and nothing sinister happening? Hmm. I am. I had thrown on loop all weekend to prepare. None of that is useful here. Oh, how am I? It was fun to watch. I agree. Having thrown on loop is fun to watch. Why did you mention something sinister? You need to get your ears clean, honey. I said nothing sinister happening. See, nothing. Isn't that a whole lot more, a whole lot more, a lot more comforting? Uh, so, Sea Hack Omega kind of, you know, like sus. Let's see, Sea Hack Bunny. All kinds of soda pop. Crumple up newspapers. Discarded food containers. What? I, I, I've been working on my trash talk, but I'm not very good. Hashtag fun. That was trash talk, you see? Uh, no, no, that, that was good. That's kind of you to say. I hope your death is swift and painless. Mm -hmm. Okay, what McQueen has to say. Detective, thanks for coming to our game. I wouldn't miss it for the world. You had nothing else to do, did you? You got me. Not a ghoul in sight. Oh, hey. Maybe for a chance of pay, a change of pace, I can ask you some questions? Sure. Let's give it a go, I guess. So, how come we never see your family? Now you're, um, uh, you're really coming in swinging hard, aren't you? See what I did there? Swinging hard, baseball? Get it? You're dodging the question. Correct. Next question, please. Mm -hmm. Witnesses can be frustrating, huh? How did you get into all that spooky stuff? Because you're the dark side detective. Funny you should ask. Our first encounter of the supernatural was at campsite, back when we were scouts. Scouts, mind you, back before the city was hit with that uh, dip 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 tax that resulted in the blood wolf being formed. Personally, I think the tax came because the scouts wanted uh, us uh, out after the events of that weekend. Sometimes when I close my eyes, I can still see it. Or when I close my ears, I hear the screams. Anyway, that was a trip that opened my eyes to the real dangers that are out there. Haven't looked back since. How do you see behind you? I mean, I've not metaphorically looked back. Then how do you metaphorically see behind you? Mm -hmm. Okay, next question. What's up with the moon? Oh! But I do not trust it. It is a shady boy, for sure. 
I like to call it a new for questioning, but it's the moon. Tidal impact alone of bringing it to the station would require a lot of paperwork. Without evidence, I doubt it would be even be approved. So for now, all I can do is keep an eye on it. See who it deals with. Astronauts. They are all my, on my list. Who goes to the moon in this economy? Thoughts on stone tape theory. Did a man on the internet ask you to ask me that? Yes. I do think places can get imbued with the physic energy of uh, psychic energy of events that happen there. That's what ghosts are, and why old hospitals are creepy. I don't see why that place would need to be big. So sure, a stone or other object could work. Maybe next season we can investigate a haunted socks or obsessed window pane. Okay, goodbye. This has been fun. Let's never do it again. Okay. Raxa, what do you say? Does this place seem a little under par to you? Like not proper stadium quality? Raxa says, nah, looks exactly like the stadium at the university. Better, if anything. Okay. So what do we have? Amelia's uncle. So this game is like Angry Cricket. Is that it? More or less, uncle. Angry Cricket for kids. How many days does it run for? Only a few hours, actually. I was him to point that. Uh, Miss Mom says, So my little army is the team captain. Uh, it, it was a straw ball. I lost. Oh, mine. This ship wasn't going to sink itself, you know. Nonsense. This is a good thing. I read on page 9340 uh, on uh, and 40 on Ah, on 41, this E should be over there. Uh, 9,341, that you can get one of those badges for this. You read the guidebook? Did I read the book, she asks? Of course I read it. Your hobby is my hobby. Literally, I had to join a chapter to get a, uh, to get a copy. Anyway, if you can uh, lead a team of Reef Raft to victory, you get the Underdog Alpha Badge. That's one step closer to being a blood alpha. Oh, never thought of that. Have I accidentally stumbled onto some kind of path for myself? So ashamed. Okay, well, Armelia seems sassy. Okay, we got Devon's dad. Will there be a lot of running in this game, Devon? Do you have your inhaler? Do you have mine? Do you want to wrestle off that crow area? Jack, please. Can never have too many inhalers. Barbara. Uh, not if you're running for your life. What else would the lad be running? Weird. Barbara says, well, this is exciting. Nice to see him getting into blood sports. Yeah, that's not blood sports, lady. Okay, let's see Emily. That's uh, Emily's uncle, Marv. Why are you still wearing your headset? This is the guy that, like, the cameraman, if I'm not mistaken. I'm recording commentary for the game. Our game is going to be on the radio? What? No, I'm recording it for me. My archives. I like to record everything that happens. At night, I get myself to sleep by listening to the city's dark secrets. I do something similar, to be honest. Uh, Emily's dad. Talk to me, kid. What are the odds like? Feel pretty good about this one, pup. They have all the training and the stadium and a full team who knows the rules. But I have a nail in my bat. Okay, interesting. And is there anyone here taking bets? I don't know, Pop. But it's a friendly kids game, so I assume so. And on a scale of one mind at all, to you'd better watch your back, old man. Where would you stand if I bet against you? I think it'd be between motivated to win and you better have hope we win. That's my girl. Now go show daddy uh, uh, that, that he's back the wrong course. I think this is the guy that had like the like the shady pawn shop in the docks or something like that. I mean, his brother. When you said Little League, I thought you meant model railways. This is all bigger and boring than a little railway village. I shouldn't have stayed home, gone through your things for anything flammable. Hmm. Okay, indoors. Sea hacks. Do it look like they're singing? I say, well, punching. Okay, I already did that. Indoors. 
Malison says, when are we taking her out? This is taking forever. And Ray says, Miss Wampus says after the safety checks. Umpire is taking his heck dude in time, she said. We bring her out, gym up, uh, gym up our ears, and let her rip. Then everybody who hears uh, her song will have to do what she tells them. I won't do that, uh, what anyone tells me, says Emily. Emily, shh. Huh? Oh. Okay, so apparently these guys are from the other teams, and they're gonna bring out like a, uh, a siren or something? Hey, what you lot doing back here? You better not be listening to things you don't want to hear. That's how people get cursed. We are uh, looking for the toilets. Too busy. Hold it in to hear anything. Uh, you better be telling the truth. I don't lie. Some people say I am incapable of lying. But I don't know because I've just never tried because lying is wrong. And if you lie, Satan comes and gives you stinky feet. That actually seems accurate. Uh, okay, I'm gonna wait over here to keep an eye on things that aren't this lot. Okay, so went over there. So what do we have here? We got a label says staff locker rooms. Huh? Team staff. It's our English for players. You know how they say stuff weird in that country, like a scone instead of scone. Or potato instead of ground flesh. But trash says more trash. This stadium is almost as messy as my bedroom. Maybe. And maybe it says, I can get up past this one. All I need is burlap sack, a car with a big trunk, and a shovel. I mean, it's kind of hardcore, like I said. Armelia says, let's call that plan. What comes after Z? Double A. My diet is an accountant. Plan double A, that's twice as immediate as A. I'll get my sack. Emily? No. Hey, keep your mist to yourself. Okay, and what Devon says. Good job covering for us, Devon. I'm glad we practiced for our team lie badge by having you lie. Then we then, uh, then me state that I hadn't lie and letting them confuse the two. Yes. Yeah, I was there, uh, Devon. You don't need to explain it to me. I was explaining to my imaginary friend, who watches us and suggests ways to proceed past hurdles. Then leaves positive reviews, hint hint. You're a weird kid, Devon. Okay, we go to the trash. More trash? Yes. We got pipes over here. That's a lot of pipes for a place that has no reason to need that many pipes. What else do we have here? Vents. Do the industrial vents help keep the plane pitch aerated? My guess is that the outside does that. Yeah. To change the rooms. Hey, there's no toilet in there. Okay, can we go like over? That's a sign that says that doesn't look like a batting helmet. No, can we go over here? Okay, so the other kid went inside and we need to find a way. Oh no, it's over here. We get an extinguisher, flammable and inflammable, meaning the same thing is my yin and yang. Okay, label, industrial storage room. Billy Bosch. Billy, what are you doing back here? I lost my bat, can't find it. And if I don't have a bat, I can't pass safety checks, and then I can't play. I thought maybe it was in here somehow, but it's not, and um, uh, I don't know what to do. Okay, this guy needs a bat. Can we enter this? No. Apparently we need to find a bat so this guy moves. Warning sign. No ball games. No ball games down here. Ball games are for the ball games area. Upstairs. Okay. See how Ray. I got my eye on you. And this eye of Newt. And also a scrying spell. So watch yourself. There's a label over here. It says, looks like somebody has doctored the room name. Doctor, the room name. Okay. First aid kit says it's more of a second aid girl myself. But there is no second aid? Precisely. Sluice Canal. Great. It just says John from on it. Oh, shouldn't touch that. It's not for us. I didn't get that joke. 
No need to go in there. What's in there? Sign says sluice. No, Emily, the other sign says no, it's not. So it's not the sluice. It's anything but the sluice. Okay, so sluice is not the sluice. I don't know what sluice is. Little man gets it. Okay. Can I use this Emily's bed on this kid? That's a little out of my league. Okay, can I use the Emily's bed on this guy? Here, Billy, have this bed. Thanks. Wait, this has Emily's name tag on it. Mine has my name tag because it's mine. Hey, mine has my name tag on it too. Twinsies. Okay, so we cannot give that guy that thing. Okay. So let's go over here. Whoa! Damn, we got a lot of people. Gremlins. Play ball, play ball. Du -du -dun, du -du -dun. Graham says, no time for uh, game leg, uh, gray ears, gnarl eyes, old and bent. Mathilda says, hush up lads, you have to save your energy for when the game begins so you can scream at the children. Okay. This is from the, uh, in the, in the junkyard, I guess. Got Gary and Mystic Meg. Oh, I remember this from the first case. I like to come to get these things to see normal children play normal children games. Our gear wagon is off at a accountancy camp. He's just acting out. It's been a lot of change for him recently. I predict he'll be smashing in mailboxes in no time. Okay, so the, the, the son is at you know accounting camp. That is just nasty. That's fierce, reassur uh, fierce reassuring. Thanks, love. Okay. What do we have here? The mall bot, Tam, umpire McKing. Oh, we got McKing and Mrs. Bosch. Robert says, back when I played, I was the king of the hook foul and the slice foul. Get it? The real basketball, uh, baseball terms, but also linked to my hook stick. Good, huh? Yeah, but we don't know anything about the game, so it's kind of wasted on us. Me either. Had to use Wikipedia to work out that joke. Seems like you could have used that time to learn about the game itself. Then come up with a better joke. Maybe. I'm always going to read this. They only play for doodly's dialogue anyway. Which sucks. Under this hat and coat, I'm a digital third strap. What? Please, you're talking to children. I'll be thirsty if I was uh, wearing all that stuff on a nice day like this too. And we're safe. That is also a baseball term. We really come full circle here, huh? Yeah. McNugget. Spend my entire career chasing down the hook killer. And then we meet on a website for retired baseball fans with uh, too much time. How's that for a tale? There are three police officer, uh, officer law people here today. Uh, if you want me to get one so that they can do an arrest on him? Son, I said it was a site for retired people. Retired. That's all in the past. So the, the, the good, uh, the, the, the hook guy killer is retired. You, know, you can tell because of the hook over there. Well, the system works. Okay. So Tam. Tam didn't bring a knife with him. Burn him once, shame on you. Burn him twice, shame also on you. Stop burning, Tam. And Malbot 5000 said, That is a shame. Malbot brought sticks that need a twiddly, twiddling for post game marshmallow melting. I guess all Tam could just hold the marshmallows in the fire using his hands. A born free solution. Congratulations. This is Malbot. Explain to me this human game. Where are the joypads? How do I control the children? Can I build, a, a tea, uh, build them a pool and then remove the ladder? I think the mobile can, might be a little bit, you know, like, dangerous. I'm gonna tap over here. Umpire McKing. Hey, Umpire McKing, when are the safety checks going to happen? Yeah, we're head to bash. We have heads to bash. Beat it, kids. Can you see I'm busy here? I file down my studs to make sure they are extra safe. Does that mean I get a gold star? Kid, that's great and all. 
but I didn't come here to look for, uh, at your boots. I'm here to find single moms in need of empty promises and shoulders to cry on. Gross. Ah, you're a kid. You think all smooching is gross. Grossness is a spectrum, and that is on the bad side of gross. Smooching is on the icky side. I have a chart if you want to see it. Uh, that's a very hard pass, kid. If we want to cross the sea hack's dreams, we're going to need to get this guy's head back in the game. Maybe we can do that. Mrs. Bosch. I hope I did the right thing bringing Billy here. He's just such a nervous little guy. Don't worry, I'll throw some calls this his way. That will boost his confidence. You do that? This is Tangy Bell. Hey, I just want you to be happy. Anyway, what's the point in having power if you don't abuse it once in a day? Haha, <laughs> you're such a charmer. Aren't I? <laughs> okay. The parking lot tap. A tap! Presumably to water the very recent late AstroTurf. AstroTurf is not from space, but can survive in space. What I am saying is that it does not need water. Yeah, suspicious. Okay, let's tap there. The parking. Okay, we're in the parking lot. Emily is sitting there. I don't know if it's safe to be up there. That structure looks new. That's why I'm here, to feel the rush of danger, and then the rush of air as I fall once this thing inevitably collapses. And a ticket stand, a ticket boy, ticket stand. Does this look like it was built yesterday? No, it were, if it was built yesterday, it would have fallen down by now. Had to be built today. I estimate it has uh, three to four more hours before it collapses under the weight of its own suspension of disbelief. Weird. Ticket boy says, tickets, get your tickets. Hey kid, you got yourself a ticket? Cause you ain't gonna wanna miss this. We're playing, we don't need tickets. Everyone needs a ticket. How else am I gonna make money if you is getting in ticket free? My rehab scheme says it's got to make money, legit, or I go back in the slammer. Those night hacks offer me what they call a very real job with no strings attached or hidden agendas. I think Big Tasty might be you know, on to something here. So many red flags there. No, no, because they said no red flags here. Oh, Big Tasty. And a bike here. Fancy looking bike. It is fancy. And it's got both speeds, forward and back. Handlebars for holding onto. A turning bit for corners. The seat is padded. And those are two of the most circular wheels I've ever seen. The air around it, uh, around us, around it, has hints of leather, musk, pit fires, oil slicks, scotch, locker room talk, incomplete DU DUI, repressed feelings, barbecues, bacon's, and cheap beer. Oh, that's a fragile, a cologne my dad used to use until he got a cease and desist uh, from the company for asking how my day was uh, one time. Hmm. I got a whiff of all that about one screen ago. Okay. So look over here. Like this guy, maybe. Uh, please, Van. I love Blood Alpha Doodly, but I question his choice to bring a fully armed riot truck as our team transport. I thought it was comfy. Once we move some guns around. Yeah, once we move some of the guns. Oh look, when we move the guns, we covered up somebody's bat that my, uh, they might need this. We got Billy's bat. Okay, good. Anything else over that? No. Okay, so these are the, the screens that we need to like, move. Billy, have this. Sure, we can give the kid his back, uh, bat back. But then he might stop crying and it's such sweet music to our ears. Emily's hardcore. Not quite what I, I was thinking. We could use this micro situation to help uh, uh, us in our macro situation. Precisely. Get the bat, bro. 
Okay. Uh, okay. What's in a macro situation? Precisely. Can we combine these two? Let's turn the name tag from Billy's bed and put it on Emily's. Does that mean I have to play with uh, his lame bed? You received item. Billy's bed. Okay. We found your bed, Billy. Here you go, Billy. Yeah, thanks. Wait. What's all this carving uh, into it about eating families? <laughs> I don't remember doing that. Do I black out at night and have an evil cannibalistic side that wakes with an insatiable hunger for the long pig? Oh no. Uh, am I in a Dr. Billy and Mr. Bosch kind of situation? This might be getting out of hand. The stringy one is onto us, says Mr. Bosch. We have to eat her to hide the evidence. You see, Mr. Bosch has like a, a red background here. There is no meat on those bones. Things of the indigestion. I think we might have awakened something in Billy. I don't like this. I want my mommy. There's a mommy. Hey, baby. What's up? Pudding cup. Mama, I think I might be a people eater. Oh, Pudding, I was worried you might inherit your father's illness. What? In our defense, what were the chances? One in uh, 4,973,421. My poor baby, my poor hungry baby. I could use a hug, mommy. Preferably after you cover yourself in hot sauce. What? Okay, well, that that went dark, you know. So now we entered this. Okay, what do we have here? Mop bucket. He's having a bath. Oh, there's a rat over here. Better him than me. Mop bucket. Ponchos. Stockpile of thick plastic ponchos for bad weather. We got the ponchos. We're gonna use those. A wrench. A wrench! You can dismantle all kinds of stuff with one of these. Let's take it. We got the wrench. Pipe wrench. A pipe wrench could be useful. But with all the pipes down here. Sadly, we got uh, one wrench a day and we make our pay. Okay, we got that wrench now. A rat. A rat, yes. Brown River Rat, speci uh, specifically. Uh, barf River Barf, more like. And the rat says, rude. Label says, top box. First place, well done. I think it just means it's the box on top. Top of the box podium, you mean. Box. I saw a teddy bear? Hey there, little friend. What an innocent and cute bear. This is Wilson. Right there. Let's mark all towels in case of leak. This box is damp, the label is washed off, but I can make out the words spare water. Beavers, rehydrate in case of emergency. Beavers? How did they dehydrate in the first place? Well, the, I do not actually want to know. This says dental dams, wrong delivery address. It's hard to see their label in the dark, but I think it says shadows. Hashtag pop. Hard to see the label in the dark, but I think it says shadows. Okay. So, I guess nothing else. So, let's just go out. We're gonna go over here. Oh, my king is now here. Might as well get to it, since that hottie went off to look after her dumb crying kid. The the, the kid with the, you know, uh, uh, with the, the dual, like, monster personality thing. The Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde thing. Right. Got around your brats. Time to go and check your gear. Come on. We'll be right with you. Whatever. Matches. Shouldn't you stop us taking these? Hmm, let me think. Out of the spooky matches? That's McQueen talking. Nope. They're not possessed or anything? They are not. Do they whisper for you to do terrible things? None of that. Sadly, says Emily. I don't care. Yes. 
Okay, we got the matches. So we got matches, we got a wrench, and we got a pile of punches. Okay, let's go over here. Okay, so this is what we need to do. For instance, we take the wrench and we use it here. That's a little off my league. Can we use this with the punches? That's a swing and a miss. Strike! No. That's a swing and a miss. A little out of my league. Okay, so we got a pile of punches, we got a wrench, and we got matches. Hmm. Can we use something like this? Okay, let's pop a wheel off this bike. My poor, beautiful friend, sorry about this. Ah, don't you dare politicize this. Demically speaking, my dear De uh, Devon, we're not killing the bike, just benching it. So now to speak, uh, to use the terminology of the day in hand. Sticks out tongue. Okay, we got a w bike tire. Can we use the matches? That's a little of my league. I'm not exactly sure why we need that. Can we use this over here? It's a little of my league. Okay, let's go. Let me see over here. I uh, got the vent, we got the crow. Can I put this there? That's a swing and a miss. I'm thinking this is to light some trash on fire. Pipes. Can we use this here? Oh, I think we can enter here. Oh, look at this. Armelia. Oh, there's a big fish here. Yeah, it's a siren, you see? Uh, Helen Vetica. Excuse me? Not a big fish. I'm a big fish lady. Sorry. There's a big fish lady here. That's more like it. Okay, so... What is this? It's a siren. You're not the kids who caught me. Caught you? I ain't here by choice, a child. Those little purple freaks fish me out of the water like, like, like a common fish. So undignifying. Uh, they've stuffed me in here with some song lyrics about the land full of bees. The ink is running in the water and are making me work for them. I do not dig it. Okay, what are you? Soulful cousin of the mermaid, a rock star of the sea. I'm a siren. Okay, what did they catch? Uh, what did they catch you? As sirens have powerful lungs, little lady, I can bend people's will with my songs. We used to make fishermen crash their ships into rocks or jump overboard to meet us. These purple fish nappers promised me I could go home if I sang my song here to start some kind of game. Why would they want that? Some land nerd stuff to do with people jumping on resonant frequencies. Oh, if you know people jumping sink, they could make whatever they were jumping on shake and shake until it broke itself apart. Yeah, something like that. Anyway, once they're done, I should be free to swim home. You know. It's a dam. That explains why this whole match is taking place on a dam. This whole match is taking place on a dam? They want to destroy the dam? I didn't think it was an odd place for a game. Devon says, I brought a snorkel in case I had to go after any stray balls. Okay, that's weird. If they break this dam, Twin Lakes will be flooded. And then I can swim home. Exactly. I can we do to help. Just want to go home. You might not be able to tell with your limited five senses, but this fish tank is a lot smaller than the world's oceans. So if we can help you escape, you won't sing the song? Sure. How do we know we can trust you? You probably never heard of this, but I'm part of a special group whose award is their bond. I invoke the power of a scout's honor. What? Scout's honor? These are bloodhounds. How do we get a fish lady out of here? I got my pet goldfish, may he rest in peace, took it home in a plastic bag. Deep mother saved me. Okay, goodbye. Oh, hurry up. I'm due to go on any moment now. Well, we have this pile of ponchos. Strike! Okay. 
Locker 5, Locker 4, Bin. This bin is deep. How deep? It goes all the way. Shut up. It can't. All the way, dudes. Never thought I'd see it. Not in this lifetime, no. I don't know what that was. Locker 1. There's a flyer stuck onto the inside of the door. It's got that crinkly stiffness of paper dried after getting wet. Okay. A title. A night of drowning in deep mother's hits. Okay. This is like Mighty Cthulhu, you see? She's indescribable, but that's mostly because of the resolution. Hashtag pop. She might be a monolithic monstrosity, but she has showmanship. Okay. She's indescribable, yes. Tour dates. Why is 10th uh, January really a uh, uh, March 15? Really? Up? Yeah, you see? Cthulhu. New Atlantis. Dwarka and Kisek. So now here, look what my cousin from New Atlantis sent me. She's so lucky her family moved there. The, the rest of ink has bled from water exposure. Okay. This one has a dangerous knife in it. You mean a sweet knife? I don't know. I didn't taste it. It's sharp. I don't know where it's been. Receive an item. Sweet Safton. Can we do this with that? Strike. We do this with this. A little out of my league. This with that. We can use the clippers on this tool to remove the spokes. You receive item. Bike tire, no spokes. Okay. Strike. I'm just trying to connect random things. Right. If we melt the poncho edges and press them together, we can make a large bag. I told you Blood Alpha Doodly's class, 101 uses for ponchos would come in handy. I am as surprised as anyone. You receive item. Melted poncho bag. Okay, can we use this here? Hey, what's this? We made a bag to sneak you out. You made me a body bag. I'll suffocate from lack of water in there. Can we feel it from the water you're in? I need this water to live. Find another way to fill it. Okay, so we need to fill this thing. Can I use that? That's a swing element. Okay. Let me check. Locker with some spare sea hat outfits in it. Where this is going is so clear, it's almost uh, five shadowy. We receive sea hacks outfits, so we can put them on. You better have a good reason to be waving that thing at me. Okay, not yet. It's a fancy looking document taped up in here. Image. It's a picture of an octopus with greening, uh, gra uh, greening faces uh, on the end of each arm. Pfft, trying too hard. It's about rising sea levels, but that's been crossed down and replaced with a note saying visiting every underwater city, eh? That's what is dark and deep and hidden guides us. May the deep mother sink cloud our eyes so our vision can be clear. Also, like, she just gets me, you know? When I hear her songs of madness, it's like they're written about me and my stuff, which is, like, totally cool. There's a whole section here about cookies and morality, one of the great philosophic arguments of our day. There's a recent addendum here. Okay, so the cookie thing was a bust. Let's kick things up a notch at the little league game. See? Signature. Where the signa no signature normally goes on the uh, things, it's just a wet sucker print. Definitely trying too hard. Okay, anything else here? I want to drop a bomb on the enemy home turf, but I went after uh, breakfast. What? Felt like we're behind enemy lines. Do that again and I'll get Emily to bite you. Okay, sorry. A vent. This must be how Devon could hear her. Okay. So, I guess we can get the water. Here's the dugout. I guess we can get the water from here. Let's fill this monstrosity up. You receive item water bag. Okay. Surprised that a, a godless bag is holding all this water. Not a leak in sight. You don't earn your five whispered batch without melting your fair share of ponchos into bags. Huh? Okay, let's go get the mermaid lady. What happens if we go over here? 
Oh. Use canal. Okay, so maybe we can lock gate. Flush button. Flush gate. Run off. I think we can do this with the like with the siren lady. Okay. Here, we made you a bag to get into. Neat. How do I get in? Oh. I once saw a shoe uh, a show where a dolphin jumped through a hoop. Can you do that? That's the meaning. Is more demeaning than being trapped in a tiny glass case and being forced to sing for your freedom? It's on par. Fine. Find me a hoop to jump through. I have a hoop. Okay, let's do this with pizzas. Save your applause for the end. But do applaud. Huh? Woohoo! Nice. That was pretty cool, actually. This isn't the roomies of accommodation, so let's just cut the chit chat until I'm out of here, yeah? Okay. Can I just. Can you use this? I better have a reason for waving that thing at me. Okay. Just. Okay, well. How do I take this? Damn it! I can hear people returning from safety checks. If we leave now, they'll catch us and stop us. Can we use this? Must be how Devon could hear her. Um. Okay, well. Can I use the things now? I can't believe we need to dress like those jerks. Can't believe anything about this day. Can't believe it's now butter. What? Never changed, Devon. Sorry, literally about to change. To look like a sea hair. That's not the, the plan. Now we look like sea hags. You see? So let's go. Damn it. Can hear people return from the safety checks. Just as well we're in this utterly foolproof disguises. Should be able to slip out unnoticed. The saying it make it more true. I'm hoping so. Yeah. Nothing weird here. You see we're just carrying this siren. Sea hack Malicent. Hey, how's it hanging? How's what hanging? You know, it. Mm. Excited for the game? Any secret plans or schemes you're looking forward to? Not talking to you, you're acting suspicious. Yep, wouldn't want to talk to me either. I am acting very suspicious. Good call. Have we got? I don't think we'll get past her. Okay, let's, let's go over here then. No need to go in there. What's in there? Sign says it's loose. No, Emily, the other sign says, no, it's not. So it's not the sluice. It's anything but the sluice. Little man gets it. What we get here? I admire your tenacity, but I don't think we'll all fit in there. Okay, we got an issue. Um, okay. Water tank. What's that floating at the top? They had me there for a very long time, okay? Oh, there's poop. Bean is deep. How deep? It goes all the way. Shut up. It can't. All the way, dudes. Never thought I'd see it. Not in this lifetime. This isn't the roomies of accommodations. Um, get this. Nothing else in there. Fancy looking document. Yeah, we already saw that one. Remains of one girl's pre-game jitters creeping through the cracks. Someone pick that. Okay, I'm not exactly sure where we're supposed to go. Sign says that doesn't look like a batting helmet. Pipes, there's a lot of pipe. Can we go? Trash. More trash? Yes. Crates. Extinguisher, flammable and inflammable. This bag has 40% more hole in it than I am comfortable with. It's the most industrial sport field I've ever seen uh, to or seen on TV or read about in all my research for this map. It does have a lot more pipes than your average open air field. Yes, because it is a dam. Okay, I'm, I, I don't know exactly what to do. What are you doing back here? It's time to go to the pitch. Then why are you here? Boss lady sent me here. Funny thing that boss lady sent us too. 
that's so. In that case, you'll be able to answer a few simple sea hack questions. I like questions. Questions like, like, what is dark and deep and hidden? Oh, the deep mother. The mother is everything. She is all. How do we align the stars? Uh, the line when the time is right. That's now how stars work. Okay, sorry. Okay. Uh, questions like the deep mother. Yes. Use the text uh, justify button on your word processor of choice. No. Okay. Let's try it again. I don't remember about the the the, the, the stars. The deep mother. Yes. Some kind of star ruler. That's not how star works. Okay, no, we need to then read something like that. Let's see. Picture. No. Lamb. Night of drowning in deep mother hits. Uh, look what the cousin from New Atlantis said. Okay. We've heard her haunting wails in the wind. You've seen her beckon you from the water. You felt her whispering in your dreams. Okay. Total eclipse for the heart. These hips can die. Weird. Number one reason why you don't sleep at night. Rolling in the deep ones. Coming to an underwater city near you. I have a bad feeling I know what their uh, game plan is here. You score more points than us? That's a solid plan. Glitz. She might be a monolithic monstrosity. Okay. I think we need to just take a look at all the... Um, at all the like hints here. And that might give us... The... Answers. Title. The Sea Hack Charter. Picture of an octopus. Column 1, column 2, column 3, signature, column 4. Uh, that was dark and deep and hidden geysers. May the deep water ink cloud your eyes. Okay. Yeah. This one, it was an obvious rising sea levels. Visit every underwater city. Okay. Whole section about cookies and morality. Okay, the cookie thing was a boss. Let's kick things up a notch uh, up the little game. Okay. Let's see if we can just talk to this guy. It's time to go to the pitch. Okay, give me the questions. What is dark and deep and hidden? The deep mother. The deep mother is everything. She is all. How do we align the stars? We align the stars by submerging the city. You see, we needed the plan thing. If she's visiting every underwater city, then we add twin legs to that list. What is the sacred date? We said the day when we sink the city. Yes, Twin Lakes will be the nearest underwater city when we're done. Then she'll have to come. Okay, okay. Sorry I doubted you and your pet homunculus sister. But this guy? You carry out the leader's orders. You uh, too. Okay. Well, in we go. Got a speed. Yep, 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 yep. Okay, so we are here. Um... Thank you for all this. I would have gotten over drowning your whole town, but it would have taken me days. Glad to be able to. Okay, so what do we like? The field button. Looks like this opened the gates to the reservoir. Let's fill the chamber up so we can put our siren friends somewhere a little more confident. Okay, that's good. Can you jump over there? Kitty Wampus says, Not so fast now, honeys. Oh, she's got a gun. Arms up. She didn't say that. Too late. I can't hold it. Down I go. Ooh. Oh, no. Okay, so... Flush button. Hands where I can see them. Mm, 
siren. There's even a tiny peep out of her. I'll play one of these recordings that will take you four out of the pictures. What? This ain't a gun, honeys. Oh, it's worse. Oh, it's a recorder. Doesn't sound uh, worse th than a gun. I've had Siren Friend here record some choice phrases on here. And with the push of a button, I can make you do whatever I want. Can you make us fire a bullet from our mouth? And uh, you see the recording. Shut your mouth. There, that's better. Anyone want to try me? No? Good. Afraid I can just let uh, you free my Siren. I promised those girls they could see the Deep Mother perform. So that's what's going to happen. Now, you'll just wait here, there a second while I'll find a voice clip that will force you to work for me. Quick, stand back! Okay, grab the thing. Phew, well done. You can talk again, says uh, the siren. Did it work? It did. I don't like that one bit. Okay, get the thing. Her recorded. We may need to show this to Blood Alpha Duo. We received the attack. A talk girl. KO'd Omega. She's out cold. Should we push her into water to dispose of her body? We don't need to get rid of her body. She's out cold and alive. The second problem could also be fixed by pushing her in. Yes. Okay, uh, so how about we flush but It's not doing anything. Must have broken when the panel here was blown off. Okay, can we open this? Back seems to have jumped up the mechanics. We should take a look. Oh, it looks like the bag got caught in the system and uh, popped off some cuts. Running backwards now. Yeah, we need to reverse the system if we want this to work. Okay, so this is link cocks. The bag has tied two cocks together and now the system is turning the wrong way. Okay, so this is turning over here. Link cock. Okay, can't budge them. The bag has stuck them in place. Okay, so maybe we can take one of those. Good. And we need... What do we need? Like this one? And that one? Okay. So maybe this one. Okay. And now we take this one. And we take that one output cog okay so we take that one now take this one no that's not working there how about that one? Okay, so that is not what I needed. This input cogs. Okay, reset. Reset everything. So I'm guessing we need to have this one, like, turn it in the other direction. So, in order to do that, can't budge them. Okay, we need to move that one, definitely. So maybe we do this one. Okay. Maybe this one? I need to add one more, like there. No. What about there? No. And we do that. No. No. Like I said, we need to probably do this. Thing is that if we do that, how do we connect this? Can we just destroy the bag? Put that there? No. No, because the bag is just messing with this. Uh, let's reset. Hmm. Can we move 
that over there. We move that over there, no? And this one over here, no. So you see, this one, could we move that one? Yeah, this links here. So maybe we link that there, that there, and this one here. Let's not link there. Cog is spinning. Yes, spinning the right way. Well, I think it's spinning the same way, but okay. Let's get Helen out of here. Okay, flush. Okay, here goes nothing. Save home. See ya. Bye. Woo! Nice. Well, that's that done. We should get back to the game. Where are those kids? We're here. We got evidence of wrongdoing. Big, uh, sorry, Blood Alpha Coach Doodly. We got caught off in some fishy business. What is that? Is that code? Should I know what it means? Doesn't matter what it means. You baby puke wearing gumbo. These three didn't make safety checks, so they're disqualified. Don't have enough players, so you forfeit, you blood turds. Ugh, even freak myself out with, uh, there with that one. Ah, shotgun. Should have done a better job of not letting you roam freely about the place. This is on me. But you see, we got this thing. As if I do wrong by the blood alpha. No thanks. Okay, can we do this with the umpire McKing? Okay, let's see what our options here are. There seems to be a few recordings. Jump, dance, safe. Dance. Shake, 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 senora. Shake your body now. Okay, I don't think that's doing it. Okay, easy call. Let it slide. I guess I could let it slide this one time. Like for that kick's mom whose name I already forgot or something. Yes, we're back in the game, baby. I mean, whatever. Stupid game. Don't even care. Etc. Woohoo! Billy, can I get my bat back? Wait, no. Uh, I see you covered it with barbecue sauce and you're chewing it. I think I'm good. What? Everyone, play ball! But you see, the, the plan was to make them all jump. And then the, the dam would collapse, and then would flood Twin Peaks, and then uh, Twin Lakes or whatever. And then the, the, the Deep Mother would come and swing uh, and sing. Woohoo! I literally had to say it, but the Blood Wolves win. We did it! Good job, team. You know what this means? I guess a promise is a promise. Here you go, kids. As a promise, if you win, we go to the aquarium. This is the best. I can name every creature in here. The blowfish, the sea snake, the octopus. The siren. That siren is Helen. Hey guys, I think I, I took a wrong turn. Ah, uh, you got kids who want to explain this? No. Hmm. Case number two, Scarface. So you see, we get we get like different cases. Chief Gooley says, "Now then, son, you seem to have found yourself in a spot of bother, so as to speak. I'm innocent, innocence, I tell you." This is Crooked Cleave. Chief Gully says, Your routine objections has been duly noted. Duly. Thanks. Best to get formalities out of the way. Get right down to business. Yes. Okay, so there's a camera over here. Agent Ma Max Cream. You see, this is like the, the, the symbol to McQueen, but in, in the dark side. So Max Scream says the footage of these interrogations will be sent back to your childhood dreams to deter you from this path. Okay, that's weird. And Crooked Cleat says, I remember that dream. 
it was it's what put the idea of a life crime into my head in the first place. Agent McScream says, we're still waiting for the official results of this method's effectiveness. Dropped out of school, left the rowing club, everything after that dream. Be quiet now. Okay, so McScream says, let's uh, press this cook. Uh, no, this is Chief Gooley. Says, let's press this crook for info on the new Dawn and their criminal detergent organization. Do you want a hydraulic or pneumatic press? Or an olic press, perhaps? Because they want to press this guy. You see? Hashtag pop. You're not going to be much help in this case, aren't you? Ideally, no. Okay, let's see what... Um, we cannot click on chief... Figure behind glass. Chief Gooley says, The state's designator, Hope Server. Hashtag pump. Perp. Crooked cleath. Man, I want to speak to my lawyer. Your lawyer has been found and consumed. As per police policy 4, subsection also 4. Give it up, son. Instead of speaking with your lawyer, why don't you admit your wrongdoings, hey, son? That seems like a trap. Praise a wild one, chase is on. Huh? Goodbye. Need to figure out most to, more to ask him. Back to the drawing board, which happens to be a table that we do not, under any circumstances, draw on. Okay, so this is the, the drawing board, you see? The reception, the camera. Footage of this interrogation will be sent back in time to your childhood dreams to deter you from this path. And this is what triggered the life of crime, you see? Okay, so we get uh, Chief Gully says, I see that we does be having a whole table full of evidence beho before us. Time to roll up our knees and uh, dive in. See if we can be linking this purple traitor to the crimes. Let's drag this lot around, see if we can connect it all, and maybe he inform ourselves as to what questions that we can bring back to grill the perp with. So we got a lot of, you know, like documentation here in this table. We got fingerprints. Complete set of finger, toe, and tail prints. Shady photo. Shady mastermind taking over crime in the city of Lone Lakes. As a thing stands, we have very little to go on other than that they exist. And I don't like them. Evidence bag. One bag of powder wash detergent. Highly legal stuff. People should stay dirty. It's God intended. We can move this, you see? Move this. We can move this as well. File on perp. A file on the newly acquired suspect. Him but does the, be sitting across from us at this very table. One unfortunately named Cletus Crook. Known as Crook a Cleet. Is it any wonder that he ended up in prison? Case file. A series of crimes that do not seem to be both escalating and assault in their nature. We get exits. Okay, the figure behind the pool glass, there's nothing here. All up, none of us leave this room until we get what we want. Okay, so we do this. So how about we put this over there? If we could catch the crook meet at, we have him. All we need is to know when the act begins and when the interval is, so we can nab them without spoiling the show. Hashtag That's another question to bring to the perp. There has to be more than we can use for the breaking of this perp. Okay, you discover a new question to ask. Okay, we need three new questions. Can we fingerprints with this guy? If we had prints on this liberty slope, We'd not be chasing him around like this, would we? Okay, what about the file on perp here? Maybe we can convince is him to trade us the person in charge for his own skin. All the trick in the book might not fall for that. Hey, you're not meant to listen on these bits. That's cheating. Sorry, sorry, that was rude of me. Now it's something to press him uh, when the return to the question. There has to be more uh, that we can use for the breaking of this perp case files 
series of crime that do seem to be both escalating and unsolved in this nature. Can we put this there? All the unsolved crimes have one thing in common, that they are unsolved. Two things in common, that they remain unsolved and that they resolve predominantly around the illegal and thus criminal act of selling the washing powder. Okay, the file on the purpose of this, I do not see being any correlation between that first uh, piece of evidence and the subsequent uh, second piece of evidence. Shady photo. What we're looking for is any way to link this new mastermind to the aforementioned new wave of crimes across Lone Lake. Fingerprints. Do not be seeing any correlation between that first piece of evidence. Okay, so we cannot... No, nothing there. Nothing there, nothing there. We combine this one. We combine this one. We combine this one. We already have it. Combine this one there. Okay, so combine that one there. Well, now what we got here looks like your dirty meats are all over this bag of detergent. Should have some cleanup. And I say that entirely unaware of the wordplay between the substance and the police slang. You see, you should come clean. Then why the footnote? Don't waste all your breath, son. I'll question the perp about that. Oh yeah. Should be enough questions to break this perp or traitor. Let's just commence with the grilling. Okay. Got enough questions? Now we're going to talk to the perp. We have your fingerprints on the powder. Son, we is not after you. We want to let you go. Small crime is good for a city. Keeps the police force busy. We're not busy. How do I pay my mortgage, huh? Another job? A crimeless city sounds good to me. If I wasn't a crook, I would pay taxes for that. And now for your cheek. We want the top dog. The Ed Honcho. The leader of the gang. You led us to him and we let you go. What's in it for me? Was you not listening, son? We get it. You get let go. Free of Scott. Oh yeah, you did say that. Well, look, you didn't hear it from me. But they operate out of the ducks. That's so obvious for a smuggling ring that I question our skills, having not checked there. But I sent you there last month, Mug Scream. Then I question your ability to read a man's character. That is on me. Yes. Are you the shady figure here? I wish. Nobody. A bottom of feather. Sorry, I meant a bottom feather. If I was them, I'd not be here. For one. Who is it then? Who is the mysterious man? None of us know who he is. Just that they're the new Don. The new Don. Some shady individual has slipped into power. What were a vacuum had been left by the proper and lawful arresting of the previous dawn, on account of the three-dimensional body hopping. Sums it up, yeah. Well now, we can't be having that. What's the next deal set for? Even if I told you, you'd be too late to stop it. So it's happening now and then. Oh bugger. So the new dawn is selling illegal washing powder at the docks right blooming now. Get your feedback, Scream. You got a case to blow wide open. Blow wide open, then clean up the pieces into a case with a lid so we can close it. Okay. Right, let's debrief. My trousers are staying on, Chief. No negotiable. For that, you have to pay extra. Chief Gully says, We have a lead, let's go. Lou says, uh, Floop, floop, floop. If we wait for backup, we could miss them. There's no time. Lou. E is on perm, de uh, perm death uh, duty for being too darn bloodthirsty. No. We're on this one. Hold on. One more, uh, once more, let us ride into the gates of hell. And if it's not too convenient, I would like not to ride back out. That's weird. This is Lou. 
Flu. Hold my calls. Flu? No, that's not a comment on your lack of ants. It was meant to sound good as we exited, like a catchphrase. You know? Christ. Okay. Computer. Lou, I've told you before, safe search only. Flu. You watch the language in my station, you the entity. This is flu. I mean Lou. It goes like flu. Wanted poster. My number one criminal after the dawn. That would make him your number two. Uh, oh, it's like a Joker thing. He will be caught, Chief. He cannot run forever. Not from us, his family, or the interdimensional hounds I set on him. Okay. Anything else? Stop flubbing around, Lou. To the photo moto. That was weird. Well now, what do we have here? Chief Gully says, you see? This is maybe the new dawn. Oh, this guy is alive. We got like a kid over there. We got this guy. Ronnie says, you got the stuff? The new dawn, which is alive, says fresh from the laundry. If you'll forgive the pun. Lowest form of humor, the pun. To each their own. Go ahead, try it. Regina, the dress. You see? They're seeing if it cleans the dress. It's got the stain right out. It's the good stuff, boss. Nice. We'll take the lot. Here's the money. Now's the time to act, or we lose them all. Apparently, you know, like, washing things is illegal in the dark side. Okay, we got a control panel, we got a key. Set of conveniently reachable keys. Small key. Okay, can we use this here? We take control of these controls, we can press this here release button. Okay. The Polizia, run! This is Fats. And this is Lim. Run, yeah! The new dancers grab the bag. Ah, uh, grab, yeah. They went inside that warehouse. Could rest the warehouse for the aiding and abetting? You mad? Last thing we need is a bunch of warehouses rioting across the city. Hmm. Set of power control for the crane it finds itself attached to. An unloading crane coming for the area with what we did being the docks. First and first most dealing with the loading and unloading of typical illegal wares. We're going in. Steal yourself, man. Strings. Sorry. Try, but I remain pitiful flesh, bone, and plasma. Mostly plasma. That was weird. There was a mechanical arm getting, like, bits box. A container of limbs and assorted body parts. Build your dream psychic later, chief. The gun is getting away. Boxes. The sign says cardboard replica of a box. Do not use. Great. Next one. Oh, they're gonna shoot us. There it is. It's the end of the line, Kappa. Nice meeting you. Sure, our paths will cross again. Blast it. It's only gone and started casting magic. Not as serious an offense as smuggling detergent, but still. Are we gonna get past this contraption? shunt? Broken machinery, they don't shut up the controls so we can set them right again. Perhaps I can seduce it? Hold on to that thought for a minute, while I just search for an alternative solution. Let's go back over here. Container of limbs. Where are we here then? I see no ears. I see a lot of crotches. Head. Got a right arm, left arm. Can we use like assemble thing here? 
torso. Is there anything here interesting? What is that? Nothing. Got the legs. The torsos. Um. Well, I don't know if there's anything interesting here. There's no successful colors that way, but there is longevity and retirement. Just like do something. Uh, left leg. This one, for instance. There. Can we install that here? No. Portal. We can reach that portal with the arm blocking the way. Thing of gone feral. It's out for blood. I volunteer. Tear me asunder, you mechanical tease. Stand out. That's an order. There has to be something else around we can offer it. Okay, so maybe a torso? What I don't know is what can we do with this? Okay. We can double click, strong jaw, good smile, trustworthy eyes, and a perfect air airline. I distrust them already. We got the head. One of these is enough for me, thanks. Reasonably fit, but not unrelatably so. Torso. We got the torso. Okay. We got the left leg. This leg leans very to the right for some preparing to be aligned to the left. Left leg. Right leg. A leg of the right sided variety. Got a right arm over here. This uh, arm is what we should call a karate chop. And we need a left arm. And that is frozen in the grapes of rigor mortis. Okay, I think we're good. So, let's go. Oh no, I need a, I need a crotch. The less said about this, the better. I need to take one for evidence. Crotch. Okay. So, now we connect the leg, put it together, and what we got? Bitty bitty bobby doo. No, a mannequin. Clearly it's a mannequin. Receive item? Mannequin. This one, see? So, we use the mannequin here. We use a whole mannequin to feed to this creature now. In it goes. Lucky mannequin. I would still like to come back later and do this saucy grapple. Myself. Nasty. Okay, let's go. Let's get after them then. Okay. Oh! Oh, we're still, we're still like in the dark side of this. Looks like we got through that portal in the nick of time. You're persistent, I'll give you that. Slim, stop them. Uh, stop, yeah. Okay, so what is that? Oh, wait, that's dangerous. Are you throwing coconut things? What a low handing joke. A palm tree. What a low handing joke. It's a kid. The little fellow doesn't see that interesting ball. Looks fidgety like he wants to dance. Parents. A wriggly parent trying to entertain the wriggler child. If only she were faced in a hotter way, she might knock one of them coconuts back at Slim. Okay, there's a bottle. Watch a bottle with a message inside. Bartender says, I am no message. My mistake, I washed a bottle with a tiny drunk man inside. Receive item, bottle containing tiny drunk man. I just throw this over here, I should nick myself for trying. Okay, we got the father, the, the father. So can we throw the thing over here? No, can we give this to the kid? Now then, now then, now then. Why are you thinking that would work? I don't know, Mira. Can we throw this 
No. And throw this over there. Yeah, that's the way to do it if you want it wrong. The tiki bar. Oh, look at this. There's a tiki bar over here. So we get some monsters. Orange monster, purple monster, blue monster, radio. Oi, keep your discussor finger hands to yourself. That's a radio. You cannot have it. Yeah, go listen to Sting elsewhere. My mouths are so dry, as dry as this sand, the sand I've been eating. I'm sweating out of orifices I didn't even know I had. This heat is too much for me. I would do anything, literally anything, for an iron scream a collab. A scream a collab. Can feel the sun heating up my pus nuts. Okay, we got a tiki bar over here. Got a barrel, an old barrel. Is it full of monkeys or what? Seems to be full of dead stuff that washed up on the beach. Oh, so full of lots then. Tiki bar, tiki bar. Only bars alike are ones which have been shut down for disturbing the peace. Okay, can we use the bottle container to this? Can you help me make a drink? Now I'm too drunk. You can help me maybe. Right then, how does one do this? Very easy. Wait, what's first? I don't really remember. Let's just take it step by step. You asked me for the first instructions when you were ready. Hopefully by then I'll have remembered. Okay. So. Caress. So, coconut. Uh, so, this pineapple we're going to scream at. And this coconut. Plomo. The glass we're gonna caress. The eyes we're gonna shake. The olive we're gonna embellish. The napkin we're gonna judge. And done. Here's a go then. Sip. Oh, what is this? This is swill. Let's start all over again. Okay, how am I supposed to know how well to do this? None of that. Okay, what first? First you want to spray them walnuts. Okay, the cock uh, walnuts, glass, napkin, rum, umbrella, olive, ice, moisten. I'm guessing moisten this. What right now? You like this officer. You beat up something just because it's a little fruity. Oof. Okay, so we pommel the pineapple next a bit above your pay grade but you need to condemn some alcohol we're going to scream at the rum now what you need to get cold and handsy next you sound like my ex-wife note that the age in hex is not an inflection of this speech hex wife Okay, so I'm pretty sure the woman put a curse on me. We're gonna caress the ice. What next? We're nearly done. Think that's all the ingredients. Put that in the container and mix it up. So we're gonna shake the glass. There can be much left. Last step, but important one. Make it fancy and waterproof. When that is done, you're done. So we're going to embellish with the ombre. And done. Give us a go then. Sip. Ah, what is this? This is thrill. Let's start all over again. Okay, crap. Just a second, my headphones are dying. Okay, let's try again. So. Okay, what well, first? You want to spray the walnuts. Moist and plumber judge. Caress, embellish, shake, lick, scream at. It has to be moistened, the coconut. And then you beat up something just because it's a little fruit. Mm. Okay, we pommel. And it has to be the pineapple. Ice, olive, umbrella, rum, napkin glass okay next beat above your pay grip you need to condemn some alcohol okay it has to be the rum 
judge, embellish, scream at. It might be scream at? I would say judge, but scream at. Okay. Now what? You need to get cold and handsy next. Okay. You sound like my. Okay, yeah. So that's caress. The ice. Nearly done. Okay. Put it in a container. Mix it up. Shake. Glass. Can't be much left. Fancy and waterproof. So, embellish. Umbrella. Done. Give us a go then. Nope. Okay, let's try again. Spray the walnuts. Spray the walnuts. Scream at the walnuts? You beat something. Pommel. The pineapple. Uh, condense some alcohol. So we're gonna judge the rum. Get cold and handsy. Caress the ice. Uh, container and mix it up. Shaking. Glass. Import may be fancy and waterproof. It must be embellished. Napkin, olive. No, it has to be umbrella. <clears throat> okay. No. Spray the walnuts. Moisten. Coconut. Beat something. Pommel. Fruit. Judge. The alcohol. Cold and handsy. Caress the ice. Container, shake, this, embellish with the umbrella. Yeah, that's it. That's a scream of colada. Pretty sure I did this, you know? Weird. You take what you need and leave me here until the rest. He leave me here with the rest, I'm starting to sober up and can't face that hangover. Okay. We receive cocktails. What this do to you uh, to call uh, your collective non-human parts? Give it here. If it wasn't toxic, I kiss you with the, uh, all my mouths. Now then, uh, how's about you give us that radio of yours? Anything for a man with uniform, assuming that uniform is a cold ring servant one. We got the radio. Okay, let's go over here. Now we're gonna put the radio over here. I don't want to weed dance today. I need it to move closer to Slim. Okay, we're gonna move it here. Patch of sand. Let's see if they won't lure him and his violently flailing parent to where we want them. Okay, so the little one is gonna move over there. Now then, let's see what happens when we try to go through the portal. Okay, so the violently flailing parent is here, so we try to go over here. Here goes nothing. Hit me if you can, Slim. Uh, hit, yeah. Ah, yeah, you see? We did it. We did it. Gotcha. Okay. We should search Slim first. Might have had some clues as to the Don identities on him. Let's check his pocket for clues. Let me know if you find any lint. All this hovering after them really works up an appetite. <laughs> Idiot's Guide to the Occult. A cheat sheet. Set of portalic instructions from a bright side book. Okay. Let's go. Just made it. Okay, what is this? This looks like an accountant. I think I lost a toe there. You don't have a toe there. Okay, audio booth. Machine. Conveyor belt. Well groomed man with steely jaws and trustworthy smiles. Exactly the kind of person who shouldn't be trusted. 
Fixing the roads is our highest priority. Fixing the roads is our highest priority. Lowering taxes is our highest priority. Lowering taxes is our highest priority. Job stability is our highest priority. Job stability is our highest priority. They're building politicians here. Affordable housing is our highest priority. Affordable housing is our highest priority. Weird machine. Looks like that contraption got itself back up and running and started to pump out old men. I have a chilling sense of deja vu. Okay, let's go to the next room. The new dawn. Damn again. Fats put an end to this. Sure thing about put more holes in them than a Michael Bay movie. Stop shooting. Canes. An oak stick. I'll take one of those. Receive item. Cane. Can we use the cane and throw it here? Not long enough to reach up there. The vine cannot hold the elephant. The vine cannot hold the elephant. Hmm, we need to find another way up. If we use the cane to the portal controls. That's the way to do it. If you want it done, wrong. That's it. Okay, sorry. Eat lead, copper. He has a pin down. We need to way past him. Okay. He just gave to your call to cheap sheet. Can I do this? No, I don't know. Can we put this over here? Can we put that over there? No. Put this on there. Maybe I can get near enough to hook somebody off that belt. Can't get them from here. Mm. How many canes does one man really need? I don't know. Money bag. As in, uh, as the get each way. They don't drop its bag of money. In his case, to get a way, the drum dots is uh, drop its bag of money. And we get the bag of money with the thing. No, I don't know, man. Can I do this? I should nick myself for trying that. Okay, so the cane. On the max scream. I should nick. Okay. On the cane. On the conveyor belt. Okay, what else do we have? Got the conveyor belt. Okay, that goes to the portal. Can we go back? Cane to get this. Cane to get that. We're gonna pull off uh, these two men, don't say it, using these here canes. How oh, perfectly by the villain of us. You see? Now we're just cruising smoothly. No one is the wiser. We're just moving. Chief Gully says, this is where those politicians are being sent. That goes a long way to explaining why the bright side is such a mess. Aye, not what we're investigating today, though. So they carry on making things worse for another day. Okay, that got us nowhere. Okay, can I... Portal controls. Seems to take some sort of a glyph for each input. Do you have anything like that on your personage? A tattoo of glyph based ghosts, perhaps? I got this. I wonder if these instructions can let us work with that there gate. Let's try that again, shall we? Okay. So we got city hall, glyph pattern, glyph pattern, glyph pattern, glyph pattern. City hall. This symbol is the one that leads to the bright side city hall. There's one word here that says source. Love shack. What? Mayor's house. No, not here. Looks like the letter Q to me. Okay. So, if we put this, this, that, 
this, the X, this one, that one, this one, and this one. Okay, this goes here. The politicians are being sent. Okay. Okay, yeah. Okay, so glyph pattern. Source. Maybe source. So that one, this one, this one, that one, this one, this one, that one, the top one, and this one. Okay, let's see where this goes. Oh, we are in the laundromat and Doodly has his pants off and nice underwear. And here's a McQueen. And Doodly says, I feel like you're focusing on the wrong part of this story. The wrong part? You let that Mothman fly away with the Rosetta Stone. But I managed to save the ice cream he dropped. Your pants? I lost those days ago at the races. Wait, then why are we here? Look, visitors. Chief, what are you doing here? No time to hexplain, as you were, gentlemen. Okay, that got us nowhere. Try again. That was some weird in situation going on there. Okay, so I'm just gonna try this one, this one, and that one. We're trying the, the, the this glyph pattern. It says Love Shack. It is important that you bring your jukebox money. There it is. Okay, let's see. This is the Love Shack. Well now, what's going on here? Oh, look at this, it's Ash. Look at this. Has the chainsaw, has the boomstick, got the car. This is Hawk and Hank. I don't have time for any more interdimensional guests. I kind of have my hand full here. As the saying goes, if the shacks are glowing, we'd best be going. Okay, have a good one, Ash. That got us nowhere yet. Try another one. This one says house. Okay, so it's that one, this one, and that one. Then a blank, horizontal blank, horizontal, vertical, horizontal. Go there. Guess we see where this goes then. It's like a party. I am ready. Speed on trench coat. Let's go. Letting you show that to the world would be a greater crime than all this washing powder business, which is what we're out to solve. Come on up. This is a, it's like a, it's a, it's a party. This is this McKing? I think it's McKing. Okay. There's the final one then. This is the one that says Q. So, this one, top one, down. Left. Middle, right, down, middle, right. Turn it off. Oh crap. We're passing. Now to figure a way up there. Okay, so can we use the politician ladder? Climbing on the back of politicians to further our own goals seems very thematic. And now we get this one. You're Nick, son. How did you get up here? We gotcha. One arrested goon. Okay, we go up. To the roof. We have you now, Don. Trapped. No place to go. Doomed to a life in prison. Show yourself. You fool. It is me. Who is that lady? What? Nothing? Don McFiend. Uh, we meant to know who you are? N Nanny McFeen? Wait, you are not the cops who trapped me here. You look like them, but they're the doubles. You mean McQueen and Doodly. Those meddling idiots. I'll be rich now if they hadn't interfered. But I am resourceful. I found the Don's man after he was arrested and took over. They showed me portals. Been using my nanny connections in the old country to smuggle in washing powder. Then you two, out of everyone, had to come along. Well, I'm not going away that easily. I hear wings, the beating of bat. 
Not a bat, you odd little man. A chopper. Better luck next time. If only we had guns. Guns kill people, must scream. That's my point. She got to the chopper. Well, that's alright, let down. Still, we know who she is now, and we has arrested her a compass list. Uh, broke her up her smuggling ring and uh, uncover an interdimensional political scandal. Gotta focus on the bright side. Get it? Bright side. <laughs> Hashtag button. Uh, come on, Chief. Ponce aside, you deserve a medal for all those wins. Let me take you to, I'm going to regret saying it like this, Olive Garden. Never heard of the place. Does it have breadsticks like in the uh, Olive Garden? Yes. Then I'm hidden. Third case. The Fisher King. Right. Uh, Raxa. This is it. Writing this thesis. Even if it kills me, literally kills me. So we're getting... We're getting a lot of cases, you know? We're getting like... I thought we were going to get like the final case, but we're getting several cases. So I'm gonna have to split this into like... Well, one video per case, I'm guessing. Okay. I've left my dorm so nobody annoys me. On a nice quiet coffee shop. I've drunk so much caffeine that my left hemisphere is having an outer body experience. You won't get the better of me. Not for the twelfth time. Okay. Covered up webcam. Maybe I spent too much time around Doodly, but I'm not risking the man perving on me. Okay, I'm guessing system settings. I guess it's going to be here, you know? Power off. Turning the computer off will help me forget about the damn paper, but it won't help me get it done. I should know, I've tried it a few times already. System settings. Time and date, which I don't need to read aloud as we all know what day and year this is. Computer. Hard drive, where I keep all my incomplete college work. Mail. I wonder if Sam has sent me any mail. Good. Uh, long distance is hard. It's a lot harder when the distance crosses mortality. Some parts of the afterlife don't even have Wi-Fi. Never mind height speeds. Trash. Little app tells me the quality of my accommodation. Games. No, no games. Need to be strong, right? A little bit of games. Shady terminal. I should really hide my hacker terminal really anywhere other than the desktop. That's the hacker terminal. World processor. Okay. I guess I start this thing by opening a non-branded world processing application. It's a blank page. I guess you should start with a title. If only I had one. Oh. Oh, a distraction. How timely. Alert. Message from the Sam. Everything okay over there? I'm in the World Wide Web. Everything's gone wrong. Meet me here? I wonder what he's talking about. Uh oh. What's this? It says commandeered for perfectly fine reasons. Hello, Twin Laker. Your machine is being commandeered by the VRBTL, very real bank of Twin Lakes. So we may date some mining. No need to call up and ask questions. It's all about board. Goodbye. Damn it. We kicked off my machine. And every machine, as you can see, is doing the same thing. Oh no. Same. Quick. Autosave. Nope. Weird. What is going on out there? I don't know, but it seems like it's not just all machines being hijacked. Yes, something crashed. This could be a case for Inspector Rexa. Maybe it's just some other non-ghost business. Either way, I should look around. Ah, all these noises is too woo match. Okay, this guy is a... What? It's a werewolf. And I'm pretty sure a plane crash. What the hell? Gala! Customer. Did you just wolf out? Sorry, sorry everyone. I overreacted. All these noises were overwhelming. It was like the 4th of July here. 
Not great for animals or vets, either kinds. Am I right? Please consider reduced fireworks as celebration, friends. Cannot understand a word of that. Anyone? Nope. Oh, come on, guys. I'm talking the same as you. Just my big wolf mouth makes it hard to say words. Doesn't mean you can understand with some effort. Yeah, can't catch a word of it, mate. He goes like this when he loses his temper. Not even sure he's still in there. Just a hawking, mindless beast. That hurts my feeling for him. Aw, oh, he knows we're talking about him and he likes it. Good boy. This is so humiliating. It just, yes, the wolfing out. Customer, this is Frey. Oh no! Did you just lose something important? My novel. Please tell me you had it backed up. I was in the middle of backing it up. It's a whopping 213 kilobytes. So I've naturally spent hours backing it onto these 27 floppy disks. I was on the last disk too. I'm sorry for your loss. Come on, come on, damn it. I was just about to buy some shares in a thing called Google. Ah, never mind. I had enough funny glasses already. It's a shame I missed out on those Amazon shares though. Would love to invest in a rainforest preservation company like that. Yes. Box of cables. Load of obsolete cables that the cafe owner is too scared to get rid of. Can help them with that. We got a bunch of cables. Looks like bedlam outside. Yeah, bedlam doesn't get as much sun. Plus, their buildings are falling over more. Great spot for fishing though. <clears throat> okay. So we got some bunch of cables. Computer, they all have the same message on the screen. They're being taken over. Window, it looks like bedlam outside. No. What do we have here? Braxton's laptop? Yes, I need a new motherboard to get rid of that virus and get online again. Nothing. Freya's computer. Okay, we already took the things down. What's going on here? This is the elephant. You see, the building is on fire. That's not a great sign. Siren Coffee, named such because of their dragging other coffee chains into the rocks. Hashtag. Build inside the campus computer lab. I wonder if all that machines have been hit too. I need to budge this elephant if I want to test that theory. Is the elephant from the like the carnival? Statue of Freak Singh. He used to stand around this part of the city in academic robes. He was confusing tourists, so they built a university here. Then he dressed in a cop uniform. We got a police station. He started dressing in an undertaken suit, so they kill him and zone a graveyard at the spot. Harsh. Animal handler. I was fixing this thing after somebody put and get this, the microchip from a cheap toy robot into it. Who might have been? Had to update the software, and then all of a sudden, the carnival's computer was taken over and this thing went wild. Yes, the, the carnival is. Been chasing it all across town. If you could hear my panting, you know how wrecked I now am. Oh, hey, I've seen this accident before. Okay, can we use a bunch of cables on the elephant? Mind if I use this? You planning on charging this thing up? Because I don't think I can chase it anymore. No, I'm going to tie it up so I can't, so it can't run away again. Yeah, I mean, it's got wheels, so it's not really running, but whatever, go for it. Okay, so... Oh, hey, I've seen this accident before. Can we, like, go somewhere, like, inside? Okay, can we give the cable in to this... Hey, boy, you're a good big boy, yeah? Yeah, moving the tail, you see? I'll have you know, Miss, that I am a highly educated man with a stable job in a hospital. Yes, it is playtime. Would you like to play? No, this is demeaning. It's a tug. It is. Ah, no, I'm not falling for this. His little tail is going. He wants to play, don't you, boy? You see? Of course he does. And if you win, I'll give you my leftover croissant. Ah, damn it. You have me. Okay. Here goes nothing. Her. Okay. Did you enjoy your game of tug, boy? God damn it, yes I did. Okay, well you can have the cross sample. Oh, we can enter here. Try
drop computer chip. This little chip is about the same size as my machine. Random bit control chip. Use this in my machine. Should be able to use it to do a safe mode boot of my system. And hacker voice, I'm in. Okay. Okay, so we're here. Good. Let me see if there's anything like here. Computer lab. Okay, we got this Occupy Pod Orb bag. Bag of clothes. There's also a post it note with a code and the words municipal access code. Seems rec uh, reckless to just leave this sitting key. We got the municipal access code. Police access code. If only I had my computer back up running, I could find out what they access. Okay. A server. That's the server that stores the World Wide Web. It's covered in ice. Everything is frozen. There's a sheet of ice covering the emergency reboot disk. Poster warning. Staring at screens make your bones scream. Glad to see Mother Medicine hasn't caught up with TLU's computing department. Okay, let's go to my computer. So, I use this here that does not compute. Uh, shady terminal. I use this on my shady terminal. I can uh, use this code to gain access to the city emergency services even while everything is down. Right, it says they've not actually gotten around to allocating or spending any of the emergency funds just yet. Guess I'll just take those then. Okay, you receive city emergency fund account. I wonder if these codes are like codes for a game because they look like codes for a game, you know? This one's over here. Okay, the police emergency form. This is an emergency, so I think it's okay to have this in case I need them. Um, looking back on it, I had a lot of morality if modules at uni. Okay, so what do we do now? I do hate that Basam has the high score. Today is not the day to dethrone him. Okay. City emergency account. So, we need money for something. Occupy pod. There's a man in one of the login terminals. I can make out his face because of the headset, but he has a powerful hair. Okay, note. A note that says, What up, losers? Going online to solve whatever it is that cut off my show before I go to the old face. It's signed Detective McKing. It has a, a dab of some clone and a lipstick print of a man's lips. Ah, it's McKing. Better log in and see what's happening. Okay. Time to dial in. Oh, we're going Tron on this one. This is Bassam. There you are. Wasn't sure my message would get to you in time. So almost didn't. Ready just as my machine was taking over. Okay, we got a guard, we got a work site, another work site, pyramid, basam. What's happening here? Not really sure. I was on a, um, a cross life dating platform, ghosted, to check in with how your essay was going. Then all the machines around me started to spit out the hijack message. Just about got a message to you before my machine went. Then I logged in here. In the hopes you got it. Okay, work site. I think that's the data mining camp where they're digging up all the digital gold for this pyramid. I think this is okay. So you guard. No entry. What is this place? It's a pyramid. Ops. I know it's a pyramid, but why does it exist? Same reason any pyramid exists. Somebody wants to feel important. And they want somebody else to pay for and build it. Yes. Must be nice to be rich. Who's building it? It's being built by tank thankless workers. Right, fine. Who's funding it? I mean, we're hijacking machines and forcing them to do the work. So I guess they're funding it. I feel like you're being purposefully, uh, purposefully, purposefully evasive. Well, yeah. Turn my back on my peers to cozy up 
to and protect the elites who keep things unbalanced for the rest of us. You really are a guard. How do I get in? You? You don't get in. It's members only. But if I want to become a member, all you need to make a donation to the pyramid's construction. Then you'd be a member, you get a Nido avatar too. Why would I need that? I'm literally my own avatar? This one is better. How so? It's exclusive. Right. Doesn't really sound better, but uh, this is different. Anyway, it doesn't matter. I guess I need one to get in. I better find some cash. See, you. we have some cash. Here. These are the codes for the city's emergency fund. Can that get me access? Oh, yes, indeed. Welcome to the Weary Sol uh, Solar Monkey Gang. And don't forget your brand new avatar. We got a, a nasty monkey avatar. You see? This one. Tasteful made piece of monkey art. They even use uh, lowercase o's to draw the poop it's thrown. C130. Welcome, worshippers. Okay. So. Oh, Cleopatra, you see? You may lay your thigh upon the ground. I don't have a thigh. Anything to bring one. Sam, do you have one? No, not on me, sorry. You come here thighless? Why would you do that? I just wanted to know what was happening. Are you some kind of blogger? If so, take photos from my left. It is my good side. Um, uh, who are you? Who am I? Am I Cleopatra, 70 pillowed Pator, Queen of the Nile? Reborn and digitized as a new kind of vengeful cyber ghost, Cleopatra. What's happening here? In life, I rule as a vast and mighty kingdom. I was the lover of Caesars. I inspired countless artists. I died in a dramatic and tragic manner. I was an icon for the ages. Recently, due to bureaucratic mishaps, I was able to access your worldwide web, search my own name, only to discover that my burial place has been lost. So, before the gateway between worlds was closed, I slipped out and read a book on computer science. I have decided to build myself a new tomb, one that is known to my worshippers and everybody else too, I guess. I always felt myth, you know, that we stopped building pyramids for our dead rulers. So I decided to build my own. I hope that answers your questions. Yes. Right. Would you maybe stop it? Only you're taking control over all our technology and it's causing some havoc, you know? You want me to stop? Stop building a magnificent tomb? Please. As I say, it's causing all kinds of chaos. Good. That will mean more publicity for my tomb. Nobody will forget it now. Well, that didn't work. Nope. Time to go and fix this myself. Hey, no need to shout. Sorry. Talking to her rubbed off on me. One more question. No, I am Cleopatra. No Cleochatra. Hashtag pun. I have a cyber tomb to construct. Be gone. Okay, this containing units, we have McKing. Okay, I've been trash, random girl I've never met before. I'm stuck in this humiliated bin. Why don't you just log out and back in again? Why don't you just shut your mouth? Sorry, sorry. I get angry when people talk sci-fi to me. The only Star Wars I like is the missile defense system. Just pop off your helmet in the real world and then you want me to pull my head off? Are you for real? No, like this. See, I've gone offline from the World Wide Web. And now I've logged back onto the World Wide Web. It's easy and you'll be free. No way, darling, whatever witchcraft just left you pop in and out of existence, I don't want any part of it. Ugh, what a jackass. Got wires, beholds. See how I have combined infrastructure with decor to make a modern lair that doesn't lose its sense of style. If that trait doesn't scream queen, I ask you what does. Can I give you this monkey thing? File 404 interaction, no found. More wires, yeah, I know. Core, server's core, this is where the ice is coming from. If I could overclock it, I would melt the ice and then we could reboot the World Wide Web from the real world. To overclock it, we'll need to get to the BIOS, which is a computer people we know stands for big inside operational stuff. 
Let's go buy, uh, find the big inside operational stuff. Okay. CPU, RAM, BIOS, or BIOS. Oh. Hard drive, uh, hard disk drive. Netrunner. A Netrunner? From Cyberpunk? Hell. Theon says it's not what it looks like. I want to be in here. In here? I mean, he's mine. I mean, I mean sorry. The one. Neo, you see? This is where I point to my own mind. So you can see how serious I am. Inside whose mind? Special Agent Norton, the antivirus agent wandering this part of the system. Special Agent Smith. Netrunner. Trip in this cage or in the deep web? Either, both, both actually, ideally in order. Okay. We're LARPers, like live action role players. We were in a chat room, then it went down. He suggested we take this opportunity to go deep undercover. Not looking for the one or anything. Um, just a quick roll in the overflow haystack, if you get my meaning. So I followed him. He meant it more literally than I expected. We got nabbed by a virus scanner, and here we are. Anyway, I think I locked out. I've been tested recently, so I can only imagine what this guy is carrying that brought the virus scanner on top of us. Lock. I think this is the place that keeps viruses and spam lock away from the World Wide Web. Interesting. The CPU. Yeah, we go back here. Login lobby. Okay. Ram. Okay, this is Agent Norton, I'm guessing. This must be the agent the LARPers mentioned. A okay, special Agent Norton. You should not be in here, Miss Parrish. How do you know my name? Is there on your avatar, along with your address, social security number, and favorite Pokemon? You need to be careful with that information, Miss. The wrong kind of people could use that to literally delete you from existence. I don't think that's possible. Want to fight down Basam Al Malaika of Apartment 24B Afterlife 02313 uh, uh, Close Room? I do not. Nope. Okay. Yes. So. Ram. Really important information. Guys, yeah, blocking the, the way into the Ram. Okay, we need something there. The, 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 I don't know how to pronounce this, BIOS or BIOS? In Spanish we say BIOS, but I guess in English it would be BIOS. BIOS configuration utility. The BIOS, we found it. But how do we overclock it? We need to find some instructions, but where would they be stored? Well, the hard drive? Wish my TV stand would this need. It's all keys, photos, and sorry you died condolence cards. Nothing here. A beam, mood lining. Yeah, if the mood was possessed, lighthouse. Yes. Oh, Clippy. Clippo, hi there. You look like you're averting a citywide catastrophe. Can I help you with that? In what way? Could cheer you on? Ask you unrelated questions? Just chip in with irritating questions at inopportune moments. None of them seems helpful, uh, helpful, Clippy. Oh, is it not? It helps give me a sense of purpose. Does that make it okay? No, Clippy. Archivist. Hello, my child. You look lost, drift, disoriented. Worry. I am the Archivist, Curator, Chronicle. I store, categorize, log all the information on the World Wide Web. Some days, as many as two or three pieces of information need to be checked, tagged, filed away. It is just as well dial up speeds are limited, capped, finite. If data came in any faster, this World Wide Web would be a lawless place. I see you have an assistant. I am not sure I would define, describe, categorize him as an assistant. It's just a clippy. But he is there, anyways. Always, ever present, suffocating. 
I sense an opportunity, fortuity, serendipity. It's no use to me, but you, you don't know this place. Take him with you, he can be your guide, shepherd, escort. You have my blessing permission, downright insistence. I need to overclock the bias. Would you know where I could find its instruction set? I did have them, but they're gone. Lost, missing now. Then C-130, Cleopatra, you know, took over. She ordered them purge, remove, destroyed. Damn it, is there anything we can do? In her hubris pride, Chespa, she only had them removed from the hard drive. She never ordered them cleansed, flushed, deleted from the RAM. Perhaps if you can find a way in there, you will find what you seek, desire, need. Okay. Goodbye, Chirio. So on for now. Information. This is my collection of forbidden knowledge. Once I log it, I forget it. Remove all records, I have no idea what that self is anymore. My Ninja Turtle fan art. I hope to pitch a cartoon on this someday. My guy, I have some bad indigestion. Don't take it from him. I think it's all he has to stay... I think it's all he has to stay <laughs> saying here. Yeah. This is my to read stack. Any day now, I'll have time to begin, start, get into it. Right? Right? Yes, maybe. Every theory ever written about the works of David Lynch. Interesting. Okay, Clippy, we go. Look, Clippy. Come on, bro. Hi there. You look. Yes, actually, yes. Come with me. Yippee! I love being helpful. I need you to be quiet. Not gonna happen. You receive new item. Clippo. Okay, so can I use Clippo to open, open, unlock this? Hey Clippo, I found a way you can be useful. Really? Yay! Ah, my limbs. Why are you twisting them like this? Please no, not the lock. I'm too big. Ah! And the bolt is open. Okay, these guys are here. Good. You're free to go home now. Home? No way. I'm gonna take out that agent. Ah, how he defeated us before. We need guns. Yeah, that's it. Can you get us some? Yuck, I'm not getting you guns, but if I can figure out some other way to help, I might. I want to overstretch myself. Okay, off you go. I don't think the one wants you to go after the engine. Uh, I think the one wants to go after the engine that took us down or something. Not ready to give up on some action, if you get what I mean. Can I give you this? Does not compute. Okay, the interaction you want is hidden behind a paywall. Too broke to pay the 99 cents. Sorry. This is a place that keeps viruses. Can I put this over here? Um, nothing. Yes, I need to equip LARPers to defend, uh, defeat an antivirus. Do you have anything stored that might help with that? You need to switch him off, deactivate him, power him down. I have a picture, photograph, image of his mother. Perhaps wearing those uh, would turn him off. It's worth a try. Can I have them? No. I like to help, but C13 is watching the flow of data. If I give something out but do not replace it, she will know, be aware, realize. What if I gave you something new to replace it with? Would that balance out? I suppose that it would. I would need to be careful in tagging it. I would head for a person to search for one image, but get something unrelated, irrelevant, inappropriate. That is not what the World Wide Web is about. Okay, I'm gonna... I'm gonna give you this. Could you use this? Monkey printout! Hmm, could trade, swap, exchange these mags for an old lady. There are spare copies of the Spatial Engine's mothers. Do not ask why I have them, uh, for I do not know. Remember, want to admit to. We got masks of mothers. Mask of Special Agents, Northern Mother. They are subnet masks. Huh? 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 That makes no sense. Yeah, sorry. Doodly may, uh, makes being a psychic seem easy, but boy, it's hard work coming up with these things to say all the time. Okay, I'm gonna give you these things to you. Here, use this to defeat the agent. What? Masks? Of an old lady? Not any old lady. The agent's ma'am. Going there with them on, and I don't know, scold him, I'll do a sexy dance or something. Psychological warfare. I did say I wanted to be in his mind. What do you think? Well, we couldn't defeat him by conventional means, as long as we keep this to ourselves. I would head for the idea of somebody's personal data being used against them to become something that the World Wide Web was known for. Impossible. Let's wrap in. Go in. 
They are young, dumb, and free. I wish them well. Okay, let's go over here. You will not get past me. This guy is doing the dance, and this guy is just tapping there, you see? Mother? Being a very naughty antivirus. Mother's deeply disappointed, says the one. The trip says, I also, uh, I also your mother, shall now dance for you. What is happening? This is her cue to sneak by, I think. Okay, instruction sets. Bias instructions. Nice. One step closer to unlocking this mother bother. Okay, we got the hardware manual. Platform. Those ominous red stairs aren't a sign we're on the right track? I don't know what it is. And the bad man used my protection but never pay for it. Tell mother all about it. Can't believe that worked out. My sexy dance is nothing. This is a bust. I'm blogging. Weird. Sobbing noises. So glad she's done. She's gone. She kept trying to turn the World Wide Web sexy. That's not what it is for. Okay. Let's go to the bias. Use this thing over here. Okay, we should be able to use this data to overclock this without tripping it. Let's do this. Oh, babe, I love your enthusiasm. Okay, babe, tell me what's good. Uh, what the good book says. So according to the manual, we're sending machine code instructions into a serial bus. Then they are executed at once. We need to set the serial collector around to whatever energy points we want it to. Well, collect. Okay. Finally, you need to route the serial collector back into its core dump. The flashing green place. This one. So it can unload the energy. Says we can overclock to 150. More than that, and it will trip out. Less than that, and we've clocked or underclocked. Both useless. Okay. Whoever wrote those instructions clearly knew a lot about computers, and they just grab a few dumb terms and use them willy nilly. Which is good because it made understanding this process a whole lot easier. Let's do this. Okay. So, basically, we're like playing, you know, like snake. Or something you see we gotta go over here go over here go over here there 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 so we're going to move move on the block there turn right move on till block uh this might be a problem because I don't think we have enough enough things. Hmm. Let's see what happens with this. If I put because I don't know if this blocks, you know. Um, move until blocked. To block no this should move us here maybe turn left move to block turn left move one to left move let's see okay could you complete my instructions and cry it out okay Reset. So that moves there. Okay. So move until blocked. Clockwise. Move until block. Clockwise. Move until block. Let's see what happens if we do this. Two hundred. I overclock it by too much and it tripped out. One more try. Okay, so I need to overclock it by only one fifty. Help, please. So the bottom row is a serial boss. The play to execute your okay. Uh, to pick up three of the red batteries. Yes. Okay, so we need three of the batteries. I'm thinking it's easier. Move. Turn right. 
move until blocked turn left move turn left move turn left move until block I guess this will work we did it 150% energy that should overclock the system and melt the ice let's go see trying to heat up quick let's get to the CPU okay works the ice is melting go team us how dare you try and stop me i will not be denied my pyramid instead i shall grant you the honor only bestowed upon the most favored of a pharaoh's servant to be buried with them ah oh, crap we're trapped what will we do has to be a way out why do you go and make the halt a mo uh, golden uh, go ghost lady angry? Sorry, I, I, we made the hot golden ghost lady angry. Core. Is the ice melting? Maybe some bloody line would randomly pop in the reboot disc. But Sam, I love you, but you're uh, talking crazy, Jack. Oh, you know how hard it is to pop in the disc? Most of people would go mad trying to figure that eldritch technology out. This is what we brave digital alchemists are always being asked to fix routers and printers by the lay folk. Or you see, I will have my tomb, and you can rest in it with me. Ha 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 ha! Why do you go and make the hot golden ghost lady angry? I already died once. I don't want to die again. Can we take our thing off? So I just pulled the finger off and yeah, that's it. You see, it worked, I'm free. Okay. So now we take the breaking case of emergency or reboot disc for the World Wide Web. We receive item, emergency disc. Now we put this here. Time to reboot the World Wide Web using this floppy disk. He's done. No, you have reset my dynasty. All gold mining is frozen. I can no longer afford to give you trapped. I am powerless. Well then, my king, if you will leave that prison, we can lock her anyway. We can lock her away in it. Fine, I guess. Well, this is undignified. Come on, my king. We should go get a ZX Spectrum to properly put her away. The ZX what now? Spectrum. Stats for spectrally upgraded mainframe. They're ghost catching units. How else do you think it powers all those games? Need. Come on, let's go. Catch you later, babe. Not if I haunt you first. Finally, my chassis was starting to itch. Okay, let's go put this thing to rest. Hey, Puff, get here. What's. But the case, says McQueen. Case, you said you were racing here for fun, not work, says Dudley. Are you seriously not even a little out of breath? Honestly, I wasn't even running, detective. Uh, anyway, case? No case. Also, culprits have stopped and arrested by Mc by McKean. Yep, thanks. I'll take it from here. Even brought an Amstrad with me. You know, computerize it or something. Wait, how did you get here? Charge your cl and change your clothes. You were just behind me? Who is this? I don't know you. Good work, my king. Yeah, this will look good for your promotion to lieutenant. That's lieutenant in charge of all Twin Lakes detectives. My crap. Chief, you can't be serious. Sorry, my queen. This is Chief's call. Orders from the mayor's office. Haha, <laughs> I'm gonna be your boss, my least favorite employee of every month. Oh man, first we missed the case, and now this? And I even ran? Alright. Case closed. And we got an achievement Crypt Keeper. Okay, and that was the final case of Tales from the Dark Sides. It was like an anthology case, you know, three case for the uh, cases for the price of one. So yeah, 
This concludes uh, the Dark Side Detective Season 2, A Fumble in the Dark. I hope you enjoyed this series. That's it for now. See you next time. On the dark roads of Montana There's a shadow in the dirt The whisper of a mountaineer In a ragged flannel shirt He walks the stony hillsides With his mandolin in hand but you'll never see his face around this long forgotten land